we have Vladimir Putin of Russia speaking out, stating that they are against the militarization of space. And they're saying, but the U.S. sees this as a theater of war and that that has to change. Now, I'm not buying his excuse that they don't see this as being a domain of war because they have already made moves showing that they see it as otherwise. He's just trying to make himself look good out here on this world stage and, and prop up the United States as the bad guy once again because Russia has lasers up there. They've done some highly suspect stuff that's been happening in terms of space over and over again. All the nuclear components all over this planet that they've let leak and radiate all over the place that they've lied about and covered up time and time again. And when it comes to space, we know that they've just recently launched these satellite-eating machines. They say, oh, it's to go up there and to help clean up the junk up in space. And the U.S. military is like, no, it's not. This thing can eat anything. What you're putting up there is capable of latching onto any satellite and chewing it to pieces and destroying it. So it's basically a weapon, they say. You can sit there and try to say you're trying to clean up the space junk all you want, but that's a farce. And it's exactly what they're saying. And they're obviously in front of the whole world saying, hey, we're moving to this frontier as a domain that we're going to weaponize. And there's no way that Russia's just going to sit back and watch it happen and not make moves. So what does Russia say? They say, well, we don't want to do this, but because they're doing it, we have to now. Well, you've already been involved in this as far as I can see. So for what it's worth, I just wanted to put it out there and let it be known that Russia's trying to take this stance that they're against it when they already have several things up there that could be considered weapons as is in terms of just satellites right now. Not to mention, if you were to put one of their hypersonic missiles on one of them satellites, I mean, then what? I mean, all it takes is that. Who's to say they don't have them up there already? If not many countries. Anyhow, this is the latest. I'll leave a link. I'll continue to update as things change. Follow me on Twitter for breaking news. DLive for exclusive live streams. And hit that subscribe button here on YouTube to make sure you're getting notified for all my videos. Much love.